You might have previously learned from one of my videos about a week ago that the Sidemen were launching a vodka. Well, that has been launched today, and it seems to be very successful. They launched the final trailer on their Twitter page yesterday. Now, there was a bit of skepticism as to why the Sidemen were launching a product that was only to be sold to over-18s, considering a semi-large portion of their audience is under 18, and it's sort of at a convergence point between, like, 13-year-olds up. But the launch seems to have been very successful. They went on Side Plus and they talked about it for a little bit in a video. Here's a bit of that. What's that? What is this? Yeah. It's off vodka. What else is it? What else would it be? Oh! oh. Okay. Brand new. Excellent. X vodka. Wow. Wow. This is actually Ethan's bottle, as you see here. Ethan Payne. Yeah. But right now, he's Batman, so we're holding on to it for a bit. Uh, we, 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 we've taste tested this. You haven't got it. I haven't. I smelled it. You, you, you've, you've, ever, you've ever tried a sip of this? Wait, is that our vodka? It's our vodka. No fucking way is that our vodka. You're joking. Wait. It's the first one as well. It's got our names on it. The side one. That, do you know what? Let me just... What are you about to do? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that just... It's fucking amazing. That. So... A vodka. If you sold that, how much would that be worth? This one specifically. Highest bidder on Side Plus. How much? If KSI lick it. Wait. Lick we it. Should, uh, uh, <laughs> KSI. KSI <laughs> licked <laughs> bottle. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no. The best thing is how easy it was. He didn't even question it. You just went. Uh -huh. <laughs> so then. Sorry. Wait. We should. We should give it away. We should. We can give away Toby. That's mine. Yeah. I'm gonna go. Wait. Oh, wait. Side wait. Side wait. Side oh, now there's a plus, you can win I want Toby's the bottle. one no. right here. I want to have the bottle. KSI is basically surprised at the good taste of their own vodka in that video, which I think is genuine. I don't think KSI is particularly a deceptive guy by any means, so, you know, I don't think he's going to put on a face for the sake of marketing purposes. Also, the XIX Vodka Instagram page was launched a couple of days ago, and basically, this is just another thing to add to the plethora of successes that the Cybermen have had, especially over the last couple of months. They've massively grown all of their four years YouTube channels. The Cybermen now have over 13 million subscribers. They upload once a week, obviously, for Cybermen Sunday on their Cybermen main channel, and then they do every day on Cybermen Reacts, every couple of days on more Cybermen, and it's translated to unprecedented number of views. Vicstar has tweeted regularly on his Instagram that they've broken their record month after month after month. That In June, they had 300 million views. In July, they had 378 million views, and basically, they've just topped it over over and over again. Now, at the start of last month, they launched their Side Plus service, which I initially was skeptical about, but it has been a colossal success, mainly because of the amount of uh, effort and attention they've put onto it. There were concerns about whether the Cybermen were overworking themselves because of how many responsibilities they now have as a collective to fund this uh, epic growth. And basically, the trade-off has been most of their own channels have sort of stagnated in terms of uploading. Uh, KSI has only recently uploaded, in fact he uploaded yesterday, uh, and all of the Cybermen basically on their individual channels have only uploaded several times in the last couple of months. They seem to be handling it somewhat well, so ho hopefully that stays the way it is. I don't think this will be too energy intensive for them because they can defer this stuff onto employees and they don't particularly need to put their personal en energy into it because it's not anything content related. They can just sort of, you know, send it to the behind the scenes guys and they'll take care of it. Obviously the success of this product is yet to be determined, but hopefully in a month or two we'll get some sales figures to see how it's sold. This seems sort of like a celebratory product for their 8th birthday, if you did not know a couple of days ago, it was the 8th anniversary of the Sidemen. There are already photos of it in shops and nightclubs and bars, so it seems to be distributed very well, and again, we will have to wait and see how well it does figuratively wise, but it, all indications show that the launch has been successful. Even Googling today, you can see all these XIX vodka queries about where you can buy it. No doubt we'll get a flurry of reaction videos from YouTubers trying the XIX vodka. I would do it personally, however, I'm not over 18 and it would not be legal for me, so uh, sorry. But as I said, well done to Simon for launching probably what will be one of the most successful products. Uh, thank you very much for watching, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.